trading stocks, making money, and getting stressed. We all face stress. Well, I think I've been stressed since September 11th, truthfully. But I have two children, both teenagers. Stay with me. One's a girl. Still with me? Tough job. While this busy mom hangs in there, stress could be changing her brain. Neuroscientists say chronic stress can have devastating effects on our brains. They studied nerve cells in an area of the brain called the hippocampus, a hub for learning and memory. It's a structure that is very important for remembering where you were and what you were doing when something important happened. In other words, providing context. For example, remembering where we were and what we were doing on September 11th, 2001. They compared brain cells of mice that were stressed and not stressed. Many of the cells in this brain area called the hippocampus show this shrinkage after repeated stress. Researchers found that the opposite was happening in another part of the brain, the part that regulates fear and emotion. With a chronic stress, neurons in the, hip, in the amygdala grow. They become larger. That could make you anxious and fearful. McEwen says the key to prevent this is to recognize when the danger has passed and return to our normal lives. I'm Brad Closer.